Okay, gotta try this again. Uh, let's see here. That's my uh, leg you see down there. Okay, so my Stardew Valley Collector's Edition came in today. Uh, the light's not the greatest, but that's okay. I had to take a turn off because there was a big-ass glare right on top of it. Now, I already had Stardew Valley on the, on the Switch and on the PS4. But, of course, I could not help myself when I seen that they were releasing a collector's edition. So... So it comes with some goodies. So we'll look at the goodies right away. Let's just take a look at... Stardew Valley... Get like a little pic, like a little drawing of everybody, of all the inhabitants. Different art style than the game itself. Ooh, this box already feels nice. We'll open up that soon. Got like a little sticker here, Undertale sticker from Fangamer.com. Guessing it's kind of like uh, I get stuff from uh, Limited Run Games, where they kind of have their own little collectibles. And we got like a Ness-looking dude. Well, I guess it is Ness. I wonder if this is like fan art or something. You could on the back it says you could buy everything but love, friendship, and experience points. And then the little brochure of all the different things that they do here. Looks like they have a collector's edition of Undertale, collector's edition of Hollow Knight, Banjo Kazooie, plushies. Ooh. Oh, I better stay away from that website. Game art posters. Official products. Oh no. When I ordered it from the website, I did not peruse the website. I just ordered my Stardew Valley and that was it. But it looks like they have a bunch of different stuff that is not good for me. But anyways, that's advertisements. And it comes with a cool poster of the uh, cover, the art style of the cover. Oh, there's Abigail. She's holding a Super Nintendo controller. Too sick. That's awesome. That is awesome. Okay, let's get this going here. Like I said, the box feels pretty nice. Looks like the edges are fairly thick. Comes with a sleeve. The sleeve comes off. Comes with kind of like a... I don't know if these have a specific name, but I guess I'll call it a puzzle box almost. And same art as the poster and as the cover for the sheet. Oh, baby, look at that. Look at that. Comes with the game. Goodies underneath. I'm probably going to get too much glare on my... Oh. <laughs> I flipped the camera. <laughs> so, it, so that I wouldn't have to do that. But I'm doing it anyways. Stardew Valley. Too sick. Let's put that there. Just a little fold. Stardew Valley Collector's Edition comic. Oh, that's cool. A little comic strip. To see the. Uh, looks like everyone's just getting prepared for Thanksgiving here. No words, just pictures. People going about their day. Don't think I see. <laughs> Pretty cool. 
we also get a deed of land. Ferngale Republic. This indenture is made this first day of spring by and between Grandpa here and after Granter and Blank here and after Granter. I'm gonna put my name in there. But fates. <laughs> the Granter for invaluable consideration con conveys and quit claims? It's the first time I see that word. It is. See, it has like a nice Stardew Valley seal here. It's all shiny. Ooh. The following describe real estate situated in the Stardew Valley region of the Ferngale Republic, together with all after acquired title of the grantor therein. Land parcel, 2016, February 26th, located west of Pelican Town. Limits known also as, in mine, it's the Sex Cauldron Farm. Sworn before me on the first day of spring by signature of grantee and Mayor Lewis. I guess his, his name is Mayor. His last name is Lewis. That's cool. Fancy. Oh, we got like a little handkerchief. Or no, it's like a lens cleaner. I kind of want to open it up, but I'm going to leave it for now. Take a look at the big piece last. I got something here. Follow the directions on the reverse side of this to, to peel off your pin's protective covering. <gasps> I got a pin. There's a video guide for peeling the pin off. Take it slowly and carefully to avoid damaging the print. Start by peeling up a small section on the edge with your finger now. Once you have the peel started, use the pads of your finger or a thumb to gently roll the paper off. Once enough is peeled up, pull the paper off slowly. Oh, this is like one of those things I want to wear. A bit closer. It's, it looks faded, but I, I gotta take off that little protective thing. So we'll just leave that for now. What the hell's up with me? video instructions as well. <laughs> oh, shit. Hang on, sorry. sorry if you hear the fan in the background there. I was uh, just finished playing some some of that uh, Switch exercise game and it was a little sweaty. So that's a pin. Yeah, this is definitely something I would love to just wear like every day, but I'll get worn out. And I gotta decide, do I want it to keep it the collected dish edition as pure as I possibly could? Or do I want to use it? Just a tad, a little too loud. Okay. Hey, Master Boo. Okay, how's that? Is that a little bit better? Okay, if you're just uh, if you're just getting here, I opened up a few things already. It comes in this snazzy little uh, snazzy little box, kind of like a uh, kind of like um, like a puzzle box almost. And then on top of it is the sleeve. There's like a special switch sleeve. Stardew Valley thing comes with a poster, same design. A tiny bit more. Let's try that. 
you open it up, all the goodies are hidden underneath the game. I already opened it up, obviously. It's not there. It comes laid out inside this. And this. Boom. I have it switched, so I don't have to do that. So boom, like that. And it looks beautiful. It's so beautiful. <laughs> okay, so we, we're getting on to the main the main piece here. Well, I guess outside the game. But there is a six-piece wooden standee and wooden lapel pin are made from responsible source birch and cherry wood. Ah, oh, cool. This thing's actually made from wood. The pin. The woods used are never harvested faster than they grow, preserving the supply and original character of the woodlands. So we'll open this up here. Oh, I guess I should... I guess I should assemble these, eh? Standy base. Standy upright five, upright two, upright four, upright three, one and three. I don't know whether I got them separate. There's little instructions here. I could get this little, uh, I don't know if you can see it. Is there? I don't, I don't remember ever doing it. I, I keep switching over the camera, but I forgot I switched it vertically so I wouldn't have to do that. <laughs> I can make that. Let's make that. potatoes you say did you just get like insane amount of cash oh wait I need the instructions okay remove all six pieces from their folders love this this is such a nice piece deed of land such a nice touch see if Kaylee was younger well much younger I would not be unboxing this in front of her she would be touch touch everything ripping everything <laughs> oh I didn't see that episode Take a look. Oh, I gotta peel these things off. Oh no. No, it wasn't him. I don't want to watch it then. <laughs> um, shit, I gotta decide what I want to do. Do I want to assemble this thing, take off the peelings, or do I want to keep it preserved? I think this might be one of the things where I just peel them off and then have them opened out. Okay, here's the base. Okay, I guess, I guess we'll do it. We'll uh, we'll peel off the little protective uh, things they have on here, and we'll get this thing assembled. And I'll just have it sitting on the, the shelf in the back. Hopefully, I don't mess this up. Oh man, it smells good. It smells a little burnt, but I like that smell. Like slightly, slightly burnt. <laughs> slightly burnt wood. Okay. 
So I gotta find, I gotta peel off a small section. When it came to stuff like this, I used to be so patient. As I got older, I got a little bit more impatient, but I'll, I won't, I won't wreck it. I won't wreck it. Almost. You can do it. Got it. Just gotta slowly peel it off now. We're gonna go slow. This is gonna be uh, some very riveting ac peeling action. <laughs> to watch <laughs> watch some dude slowly peel off some a protective layer <laughs> off some wood <laughs> don't worry we're halfway done the first piece For the last little bit, you always got to take a little bit extra time just to go even slower. Sometimes you'll have that jerky mo that jerking motion right at the very end, and it'll rip a piece off. <laughs> no judging here. Not in this stream. Okay, we'll start on one end. Work our way to the to the other. That looks nice. <laughs> One down, five more to go. For a second, I couldn't count. <laughs> it looks like we're gonna do the Stardew Valley sign with the chicken on top of it. You know, you know what? I might as well. I'm if I'm already opening up these, I might as well peel off the pin too, right? Get, take so we can take a look, better look at the pin. Doesn't look like I need to. I'm just gonna leave it on. There we go. Got it. Got a piece here. Okay, the Stardew, Stardew Valley music is supposed to play for a full hour. I better not reach that damn full hour. <laughs> oh, yeah, just a heads up, there's kids here, so it might get loud for... Loud background noise. Doing it from each side, because I don't. I want to do it in one 
one uh, one piece. I don't have to break it up into different pieces. Ooh, beautiful. Just beautiful. Stardew Valley. I'm guessing this one goes. Where's my picture? <laughs> Right here. Let's do this guy. This one's number two. Do, 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 do. Come on. Hey Dookie, I am opening up the collector's edition of Stardew Valley. I got it on the Switch, and it comes like this with this little wooden, handmade wooden, like diorama, I guess. But there's like this protective, this little thin layer of protective stuff over it. I gotta slowly peel it off if I don't want to damage the paint, but it looks nice. Say there's like uh, the stuff is on top of it, so I gotta slowly peel that off. Careful, careful! I'm putting my stuff here. Oh, bend everything. Oh, I don't have to. I keep forgetting. <laughs> See? And then I just gotta put it inside the stand here. Comes a little stand. We just got three more pieces to do, and then we also got a pin here too. After after I will uh, peel off all the stuff, I'll show I'll show all the pieces again. Okay, let's do um, number three. It's the animals. I probably don't have to go as slow as I'm going, but I'm gonna go as slow as I damn well please. Third piece goes here. Damn it! It smells so nice. It's all it's all like uh, it's all wood. Okay, um, hang on. They have a little thing here. Where is it? Uh, they're made from responsibly sourced birch and cherry wood, and they kind of charred it just a little bit, so it has like that has like that really nice aroma going going for it. Come 
armor. There we go. Oh, damn it. I have it peeling off the one side here, but it's getting stuck over here. So I better start peeling it from this end. just wearing my junky ass shorts just like I use them for like painting rooms they're all dirty I didn't think I was gonna be pointing the camera down to my crotch <laughs> Ooh, look at that looks like the house that's your first little bit of house too that's cool man except for this person's cheating they got a cat and a dog it's bullshit man game only lets you pick one Get that in its spot. Piece five. Mm. Let's start up here, I guess. Try down here. I'm not having any luck up there. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Okay, everybody, hold your breath. Dang it. Dang it, Bobby. It's getting snagged up here. Gotta get it to join the other one. Come on. <laughs> it is the most riveting. Hmm. I think there's a. Uh, is the back? Can I peel the back too? I can't tell. I can't tell if that's just regular ass wood or if I can peel it. Oh, I can peel it. Ah, oh, shit. Part of me wants to leave it on because I don't want to fuck it up. But what if it damages it later down the road if I do leave it on? <laughs> so, Grandma, what did you do during the great pandemic of 2020? I watched some guy peel some wood off in the middle of the night. Oh, 
Okay, so I thought I was almost done, but it looks like I gotta... I'm like only... I'm not even halfway done. I gotta peel the backs too. I'll go a little bit faster, because this one doesn't have, have the paint on it, right? Yeah, cause I'm, I'm thinking if I leave it on, like, it'll protect it for the first little bit, but, like, in the long run, I'm thinking it'll probably do more damage than than good. So let's we'll get, we'll just take care of it. Okay, so better undo these then. It's a little bit darker in the room than usual because I turned off the main light. Because the main light's like straight up ahead and it was kind of making like this ugly ass glare. Is there an oh I didn't even notice your question sorry is there anything on the back no there isn't just the little plastic piece and the way it looks on the wooden but uh you should get Finney to get in here get his ass to come, come here man so he just has like that nice wood look to it Tell him this is more important. Uh, let's see. No, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be dead. I'm, like, already dead. I'll get streamed tomorrow. Okay, let's get the back of the house, I guess. Well, he can watch it later, I guess. I guess. To be honest, I I thought this was going to be like not even a 10 minute video. Be like, quickly open this shit up, show it the camera, boom, done. Off the bed. But this, uh, the peeling, the peeling is a whole added effect. So, Dookie, how do you feel uh, with Mike poaching your talent, your 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 streaming talent? Totally poached Finny on you. Just letting you know if you want me to uh, to back you up, break some legs. Totally drive to Saskatchewan. Just for that. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I, I really like the way the house looks. It looks so damn nice. Huh? I'll take a picture of my camera. My camera has like a... Looks better. Like after everything's all done. I'll take a nice picture for the Discord. Okay, um, number three, the animals. <laughs> I seen uh, Mike and Finney playing that 
Castlevania game for the PS3. I can't remember what it's called, but it looks really damn good. Like I want to, I want to play that. I want to play that game like right away. But I gotta watch my spending. Got my, got my bad baby's birthday and Christmas. Yeah, it was the first time I seen that game. It's like, holy shit, that looks really good. It's like, it almost looks as good as Castlevania 64. <laughs> Six player co op? Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, every every damn game. I think I have to start uh, avoiding avoiding trailers and game news at this point because I'm because right now I'm trying to convince myself to uh, pick up another horror VR game so I can stream that. But it, I, I gotta stop spending money. that you could breed in Stardew Valley. Oh man, that smells so damn nice. That's exactly how my farts smell. Like a nighttime campfire. because there's just so much friction going on when it comes out that it's, it smells like too, like wood. <laughs> Fuck. Friction wood is what I was saying. That one was easy. Got like little fruits and vegetables. Let's get that guy in there. Let's get you to your home. Now we got the Stardew Valley sign with the chicken. Do on there, so it was a good thing I was going as slow as I was for the other ones. Ooh, so we got Let's see, I'll take a picture of it and put it in Discord. But I'm gonna keep all these little things that it comes with it. Okay, uh, where's my stuff? 
comes with this pin as well. I'm just going to put this back. So we'll do the pin too, I guess. Cause since I'm already undid those. Just a uh, secret assassin tip. If you put your own brand of poison inside these little holes, then you always have uh, the means to end someone's life. <laughs> Shouldn't have worded it like that. <laughs> Friends of the forest. That's what it says on there. Not scientifically sound, but then you just poke someone. Boom. Just don't poke yourself. things that we got inside the, the, the collector's edition is we got this I don't know what the hell you even call it I'm pretty sure it's made from the same material that you uh, that you clean your glasses with but I'll open it up and I'll put it back that comes with your own jizz rag. Because <laughs> people love Stardew Valley so much. Makes sense. Damn it, that's getting stuck on the adhesive. Badass deed of land signed by the mayor, Lewis, the mayor of Pelican Town. A little uh, fancy, what do you call those, those seals? Don't they have like a specific name? But anyways, that came with that. Pretty snazzy. Came with like a little comic book, but there's like no words in the comic book. It's just like a series of pictures of everyone going on about their day. Seal of approval. <laughs> it com comes with its own cum rag and personalized hentai. <laughs> the pervert collector's edition. <laughs> 
outside the collector's edition because uh, I ordered this from fangamers.com they sent me like this little uh, this little doodad of of all the stuff they do they got like a lot of stuff to do plushies like for Undertale Hollow Knight it looks pretty badass I'm gonna keep that in there <laughs> you get like this little card I'm guessing they, they, they kind of do like their own cards kind of like how limited run games does they, they throw in like a little few extra things in there that's kind of like their own where, you, where you, if you buy everything you you get like a whole like collection of it comes with like some kind of sticker too undertale sticker we'll just keep that inside came with a badass poster Different art style than the game, but still nice. <laughs> the worst game. My uh, my thoughts on Undertale, because actually I bought the uh, physical copy, and I was so ready to play that game, but people ruin it. But this is not the stream for it. We'll talk about it another time. <laughs> so you get like the Switch version. Comes in this little doodad. This goes here. This goes on the top like that. I believe. Not really. It's not really fitting. I didn't position it properly. And this goes on top. Comes in the box, and then it has like the own little switch sleeve too. I didn't position it properly. I'm not gonna force it. <laughs> so you got that. You got that. The little pin. This is a nice collector's edition. It's really nice. They give you lots of cool stuff. And it looks cool. But that's pretty much it. I'm going to leave it here. I'll take a picture of it for the Discord. Position it properly so there's not that gap. So there's not that gap there. And then I'll put it back on the shelf. Keep these out. Kids are old enough so they shouldn't touch them now. So everything should be good. I had to I had to pre-order this thing like in springtime or something. But that is it for me. Hmm. Oh, come play Far Cry. <laughs> I'm going to bed, man. I'm tired. What are you saying? Holy crap, farm waiting. <laughs> Just sitting here waiting. A, a holy crap log? <laughs> okay. Well, have a good night, everyone. Thanks for watching. Oh, how long I pre ordered it? Yeah. I had to, you have to pre order it. I guess so they sure up the numbers but I wasn't expecting this to be like a 50 minute video I was expecting it to be like less than 10 minutes <laughs> good night thanks for stopping by <laughs>